Hello, Jankara family people. Now, welcome to another episode of Jankara Market on Top Silverbed News 24. I uh, don't know, say now on top of the show with a story about all the Tigbogo Tigbogo where they share for with society. And today, on oh, we reason and say, we well, know the finish show. Make we look at the matter we concern us as it affects women uh, for with society. So, therefore, this one, na knowledge sharing. That one means say, now something will be saying, go help us so that we go prevent things we go fi affect us uh, for future. My name is Nadebin Pia Denigi, e your dada. And don't forget, say, if you watch us live and direct on top of the show, on top of your Facebook, just have Silverbed News 24 for your Facebook. You go feel the watch us live and direct. Uh, make I go shake any break when I come back. Now, the thing where I carry come for now today. Now, you go to land for on screen. Make one no come out time and they come back. Good morning, Lagos. Good morning, Nigeria. Good morning, Africa. Good morning, world. Welcome to your seaside radio station. We're Rhythm 93.7, the number one hit music radio station. We're number one in music, number one in entertainment, number one in sports. Let's be honest. Not everyone likes the start of a new day <laughs> or the rush that comes with a new day. If you're looking for great fun, intelligent conversations, and entertainment stories, we've got great music, great content, great interviews with all the amazing artists that you can think of. So, you do not want to miss out on anything. Stay with us, there's more to come. This is Rhythm 93.7. <laughs> Number one. Number one. Number one. Hit music station. Rhythm 93.7. throw stones in a glass house. No nation or people can achieve greatness using violence. And when we do violence or do acts of violence, it kills the other person. Before you act, always remember that violence is the last refuge of the incompetent. Peace cannot be achieved through violence. According to the late great Nelson Mandela, great anger and violence cannot build a nation. So many of us have forgotten the importance of unity in achieving the greater Nigeria. Ask yourself before you make any decision, will it bring about love, will it spread peace and unity, and will it bring about the progress of your community? There cannot be enough explanation to justify violent acts. You should not respond to violence with violence, but rather with peace and love. Keep the peace. Stop the violence. This is a message from the Silverbird Group. My name now Martin De Adeboale David. All of you they call me Lolo One. Una they watch Jankara Market on Top Silverbed News 24. Keep watching Silverbed News 24. <laughs> Now 
When I welcome back, Jankara family people, uh, I think so you see they're there with us. Uh, before we go on that shikini break, I tell when I said it's see what we want to read on top today. And no matter we concern everybody, especially women and women where they give birth uh, for with society, where they try to look at something where they affect everybody and how we go fit prevent them and what in the cause them. So therefore, what we they to read on top today now our health matter. And the person who will help me check them out for the matter on top of the program today is a medical doctor. His name is Dr. Aziz or Jack only. Uh, the next voice where you go here is our doctor. Own. So make you sit down and balance well here with Ingo Turi on top. Dr. Aziz, good afternoon. Good afternoon, ma. How are you there today? How is everybody? I did fine. How are you there too, sir? We thank God. It's nice. Great opportunity to be here with you, ma. No wahala. Ah, so sharp sharp make we run, sharp sharp go waiting. We run to re on top. I don't tell my people now say Nadia else matter. Uh, we want to re on top. And what do we want to come out for today now? Wait till you put people they call maternal mortality. Uh, you will be a medicine person, will be doctor. I beg, make you help me actually give my people what we they talk about maternal mortality waiting me. Yeah, thank you again for having me for this Obunga program. When we talk about maternal mortality, it is serious things that affect most of our women. It essentially means that uh, the death of a woman will get belay, irrespective of how the pregnancy ends, whether it born up, whether it end up in miscarriage or some other things, and the woman can't die on top of either due to effect of the pregnancy itself or due to some things indirectly linked to the pregnancy. Overall, Sha, like any pregnancy where a woman dies directly or indirectly because of pregnancy, and in the maternal mortality. And it's one of those uh, uh, parameters where we take know how much uh, women are getting adequate uh, health care in each uh, country. Like for Nigeria now, you get waiting and they take a place. Say, okay, if 100,000 women deliver, how many of them they die per year for a country? According to the World Health Organization, then say make the fee no pass uh, up to 100 out of 100,000. But for Nigeria, we will get about 800 women dying out of if 100,000 women deliver. So it's something that is very important that women need to know, especially those things that could lead them leading to death when you have to do with pregnancy. Belen are something where we all pay for, so they will get picking. But unfortunately, some of our women, one way or the other, end up you know, dying along the way. So that is eventually how we can introduce it. So for that one, uh, you talk say it affects plenty women well, well, especially you know, say in the twenty first century we day and information they everywhere. Uh, so I want to ask. Plus, say our doctor people, then they give us information, then they try to educate our women where they get belay. What will be the things where they cause them? Yes, many things they where they cause. Uh, see, where they say a woman will get belay, see along the way that. Some of them, the one we come on pass for our country, now what we call bleeding for pregnancy. When a woman get belay, can't be bleed either before, while in, while, before while in pregnancy, maybe during the time when the woman they labor, or after even delivery, woman feel they bleed, and that one they come on. You can see that kind of thing, especially for our own place there, where we they work for general hospital. Some patients, some women who don't go to some local uh, you know, homes or nurses for their home, go try and take the easy way the most of them. They will come begin to bleed by the time they reach hospital. All the blood where they body they don't come out. So bleeding, they will say they don't see early. Some bleeding, even they will say they see not the show outside. They will don't they bleed inside their tummy. That one says, if caused before woman reach hospital, they don't die. The other thing where they come from, where they like second, that the one where they take lead, where they want for fun, now that now be the bleed. Second one, the one where they be with uh, high blood pressure in pregnancy. They see when you get high blood pressure before, can't get the leg. Along the way, the pregnant, the blood pressure of go up. And that one, you will come, come with some sign, maybe like a big or person, you know, they see where inside the leg and they know they check BP. If person, they do antenatal regularly, they don't know. But sometimes the high blood pressure of fear happens, okay, 
it will just affect the woman. If you affect any organ for body, if you affect kidney, if you affect, uh, before you know it, if you affect even the baby within, so if the baby says, go me. So, bleeding cases, high blood pressure, sometimes infection cells, they cause them. Mm. Infection like the seaweed is there, you know, as we talk. However, the pregnancy works. Well, some people give them, some people make uh, abortions, then go take some drugs, infection will come in, or where they take the delivery, they know they are hygienic well. Maybe in our own local place, maybe say they don't use blood. Now, even ordinary and they take delivery. They still get infection. Infection, maybe say even drugs, you no know, go even see kill them early until we can't use IIR drugs and do that. So, all those things are common ones, which they cause. Other things say a few cause them along the way, but these three ones, bleeding, especially the way blood they lose for anybody, high blood pressure and infection causes are one of the commonness which they cause this kind of thing as we talk. This kind of thing. Uh, 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 you talk, say, one of the things where they cause the maternal uh, mortality be infection. So I want to ask question, say, if a uh, person get belly, you don't go to hospital for antenatal, they can't detect, say, the person gets uh, infection, what if it leads to the death of either the, mod, the mama or not the picking? Then if you treat them for pregnancy, may that kind of no call or call? Yes. If, if 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 they detect the thing early, treatment is readily available. Some infections, they will say even ordinary malaria infection, they will say we they see say it come on. But if person no treatment, maybe it is something else like about concussion. If it even affect the baby inside, if it affect the mama, some other infection will really come on like uh, infection of where you in the past, we they call it urinary tract infection. That one self, if you want too much, so the person will detect them early if he affects. Other infection, other small, small things, maybe say maybe person gets a wound or person just one way or the other, maybe chest infection, they get caught, but they don't come treat where if he causes with the cause sepsis, maybe say the thing will come spread throughout the whole blood, throughout the whole blood system. That one self will come even after. But if the infection is detected early, when the woman goes to early as soon as you see the sign, they do tests, um, check the test, come realize where the infection and we use the appropriate drug, which we call antibiotics. The infection will most likely go and not affect. And of course, monitoring afterwards, and they will even give the woman an appointment after the infection don't clear to even check and make sure say the thing don't go. Now, only when they know to come early or they know to treat them early, then the infection will become lead to mortality. Though most of the infection they happen after the pregnancy don't come out. Either maybe when they deliver the start, they come out for the very part, but they don't come take it. So they the thing they smell, so they lower tummy, the same person or person they feel out. Now that one the infection will be say they always affect sometimes. Okay, thank you so much, Doctor. Uh, if you just they join us on top of the program now, Jankara Markets be the program where you they watch on top Silver Bed News 24. And person where we they follow talk now, our doctor, Dr. Aziz or Jekule, and in don't they tell us uh, about uh, the thing where they cause maternal mortality. That one, uh, if mama can't die during belly or not picking that, it do either way. I hope so. Now they learn one or two things now. And uh, uh, Dr. Aziz, uh, uh, that time where they talk, you talk, say, uh, if person get malaria, na infection too. So uh, it means, say, uh, malaria for pregnancy, no be something where person knows to post treat or make person just look, say, she be na only malaria. Okay, we don't get that one, but we then go talk, say, for pregnancy, get some malaria drugs where you know supposed to take. I feel, say, some women feel the fear. So tell us how we go feed treat malaria for pregnancy. Or we say, you know, go affect us and no go affect the picking too. Yeah, thank you, ma. Malaria infection, uh, no be something where you say person for takes more for inside pregnancy because as simple as common as it is, sometimes if she affects Okay, it is even cause that mortality where we fear. But essentially, that is why we talk about the best treatment is to even prevent it, to avoid the thing before it even happens. For our women, for antenatal, we always give some drugs. We will take prevent malaria. We always tell them to save it and they sleep under insecticide treated men. Yes, but there are some drugs that we use commonly which are safe in pregnancy. Some that are based on the all the studies, the research, where they say they don't do inside this country, even outside, even for Google or uh, both places. And we don't realize that some of these drugs are safe. So once person don't get the symptoms, 
as we used to have before pregnancy or even in pregnancy, like headache, body pain, and all that. Go to the hospital. Tests have to be done. Now, when the test is done from the blood test, they come to say, okay, oh, this thing will then they call malaria parasite, they inside blood. And that one, they will come take the diagnosis done, they will come use the drug, they stay. Before, we used to say some drugs, we need to use them with caution during the first trimester, which is the first three months of the pregnancy. But now, we now have some evidence, some research outcome. We don't show, say, okay, some of these drugs are safe. Some can be used, but with caution and close monitoring. So really, even if Malaria are there for pregnancy, there are drugs for the treatment, provided the person goes to sleep early, they pick them up early, pick them early, and follow up early. Thank God, say, or in Bodom, many things, where we say, don't they take it, some of this infection. Uh, thank you, doctor. That want me say uh, all the mama and mama to be where they listen to us. Uh, well, I want you get better, no do self uh, medication. Maybe we go hospital now. Which doctor they tell us be that? Uh, doctor, as this, uh, we get one comment on top of our Facebook for here. The person talks say her name now Rukayat Abdul Salam. She talks say for pregnancy, if person get malaria. Is they possible make it pass through on bond picking with the person belly? Because I notice some people when they born, then go talk say the newborn get malaria. Yes, he get with him with the call congenital malaria or inside the, the way they just born. And the way they take up and I say that malaria we will call malaria parasite itself. When mosquito bite person, you go release some eggs. The egg will go to liver, from liver enter blood, before another one will fit it with the column in life cycle. But sometimes as they inside blood, if they day, some of the parasites, the tiny, tiny thing where they touch them, they set to inside placenta. And when they set to inside placenta, you know, in a placenta and where maybe they get the nutrients from the mother. It go come day there, then go plenty, but put plenty. When you plenty, if you enter inside cord, go reach the baby blood system if it is not cared by the mother early or even the baby where they go, the immune never mature. So there are some, excuse me, there are some where we say after delivery, the chip on get the malaria, the baby she get that. But because the mother don't they expose in you know, our environment, we always get malaria. We don't get some substance inside our body where we call antibody where we say they attack the malaria. If you don't transfer inside the baby, or if you attack her where we say the baby no go to get the malaria, but there are some instances where we say the baby P transmit. If he did transmit to the baby, maybe we can't get the malaria at the early stage. So it's not that common. That is if it's not even treated at all in the mother, the okay. sick one was. Uh, but most time, once it's picked early and the treatment is given, the baby cell will feel survivor. Thank you so much, Dr. Aziz. I hope say Rukayat Abdesalam, we ask that question, don't uh, get the answer now. Uh, so you talk, say, things where they cause uh, maternal mortality, now if person get IBP, malaria, and some things where you don't help us talk. Uh, I want to make you help us shook mat for how we go fit prevent these things. Where we say, you know, is that possible, make all these things not happen to person where person get the leg, or the ways they will be say pacific prevent them will be say you know go even see them at all at all see you go burn your pk yes we see prevent this mortality a woman die on top pregnancy and there are various levels with pacific take prevent them one one of this one where would they do right now which is very important that is what we call health education telling our women about it, our women getting to know, giving them the information so that before the team even starts, they don't get the information for their hands. I put my weight on your stroke, okay, you bleeding, pick cause the team. So if person wastes this small spot, you go quick, go hospital, and I'm waiting, I see with this, so before the team plenty, from there, they just say me, then do scan, scan, they say, okay, then see one thing, one thing, they go pay address them early. So letting our women know early is very important, and that is also the essence of antenatal care. We will say we give them information even before the thing starts. The second thing is those they can't even get those conditions. We will can't even pick them early. Let's see we get high blood pressure. We pick them through checking of the BP. Let's see where they bleed. We see them early. Let's see we get any something we look like infection. We see them early. Let's see, we get other medical conditions like diabetes and all those things. We say, sick post, that kind of uh, death. 
don't pick them early. That is early diagnosis. So we pick them early and we start the treatment early. That is another way to prevent it. Another way to prevent it, even person we don't even come get them. Say, okay, the BP don't even high. We come to say this one don't even start. We will come even prevent me if it come worse, fast as it be. You get maybe person we don't they bleed, bleed they don't play. So, okay, we want to quickly eat appropriate treatment when they get to hospital. Like ensuring that we have enough blood in our blood bank, we have drug, emergency drug. Then even at higher level, having policy involving the government to create policy like creating uh, subsidized or free health care services for our mother and their babies. That will also help them to pick up medical services as well as possible. So putting all this into perspective, especially attending vaccinator care regularly, registering in certified hospitals for the way doing work, we do okay. work and certify Oh, okay. That kind of thing will be to will prevent mortality. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, thank you, doctor. Ah, uh, one uh, person for here talk say uh, her name na Chidera and Tony. She talk say, doctor, as this. Thank you for this information you carry give us. Ah, uh, but uh, he gets some health centers where we say if we go, they know they tell us all these things. Ah, uh, things they where person feel do so that at least they will they give us better information. Yes, well, most of the government facilities, then they give us education. It just seems to say, then they give different topics for different days. Some, they start early, maybe some women they meet. Yes, it is possible that we they meet sometimes. It is good that when we see the doctor one-on-one, -on -one, apart from the education of everybody, we feel they ask the doctor where he is for the antimeter. Another means not to be checked for internet, but person need to exercise caution with information where we get for internet. For internet, sometimes we will see some information where we say we even scare person. Some people relate to what we do, we think. So the best thing I say, once we get it, we can even raise it up when we get to the health center. Ah, Madam, uh, no, so we have education on this topic. Oh, one ask question or oh, this or that, even to the doctor, then we we'll definitely respond and answer. And uh, maybe they can even ask for some leaflets. There are some leaflets some of those hospitals will get. We say we may think go to read one or two things. You check on the net, you check your language, wait day inside the Google, see if you go anyone a day. But any information we will get, we will confirm from the nurses and the doctors too. So there are means we say we should get information from them. Thank you so much, Dr. Aziz or Jekule. On top of this better informate, uh, where you can carry give my Jankara family people on top of the program today. And what else? Now, something will be say they important. Will be say we suppose they check them out for. And all my Jankara family people, they say, Doctor, you don't do well. Thank you so much, Dr. Uh, Jekule. We can leave you making the do now. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ma, for having me on Jankara. Monday. Thank you. We Happy love you. Jankara family people love you. <laughs> ah, when I hope so, when I enjoy this one, Jankara family people. But I make I drink water. Uh, before I go, I'll come back and talk my own on top of the We are our doctor. Uh, don't tell us. Make this first for my cat. We don't come back. <laughs> Thank you, family people. Now, welcome back. I hope so. Now, don't learn one or two things on the on top of the program today. What the maternal mortality? Uh, we don't hear what the cost them and how we go fit prevent and make it not happen to us. Uh, my prayer this day, we don't go lose our picky and we ourselves, we don't go kaput as we try uh, to make uh, people reproduce for head, make people plenty even more. Ah, uh, so the next time we'll go meet on top Jankara Market. They could have stay healthy for where we are there. And if you get better, go to your health center, ask them, and then they give you information. We go help you for this journey uh, where you did. So, my name is still Remy and they've been there. Denigi is your dada. And I'm maybe with Natori Mama number one. I love you all. Catch you next time. Bye bye. <laughs> I bet, look at that. Everything is good. 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 Ever
you can see our daily prayer. You know, you want to come out here. Now, as much as we have the election, they will do this one. We will not talk about men who die in silence. We will talk about people who die.